Hello, and welcome back to part 21 of my Black Mesa playthrough, and we are, I think this is the third episode where we're now exploring Zen's, uh, Zen's part of the, uh, the game, and everything is awesome, everything is lush, everything is very Avatar-esque, and I think we are going to eventually, well, I know we are eventually going to um, come face to face with the Nihilark at the very end, but I'm just waiting until we come face to face with the big mama that it was called in the last playthrough. I can't remember what the actual uh, name of it, the one with the, the hanging, the hanging sack underneath it. So we'll see. Maybe this one. Maybe this one. This actually looks very similar to um, those caverns in episode 2 of Half-Life half, -Life, half -Life 2, I Yeah, it does! It does! Mm. Even these little spiky things are in there, aren't they? Anywho! This seems to have m oh, multiple pathways in here, so... Might be a few areas to explore. So where was I? I've got I've already got myself lost. I came from here, didn't I? Oh dear. Yeah. What's down here? Get in, alright. What's that? Nothing there. So it must be up here. Ah, you're a weird species. Looks like there's some overlapping going on there. Oh, whoops, sorry. My finger was getting a bit heavy. One thing that happens when you go sightseeing and see all the uh, plants and feel all relaxed, your finger gets heavy on the trigger. So maybe leave your gun at home if you're going to go sightseeing. Okay. Oh, of course, I keep forgetting that I have my jetpack. Fail. There better not be any snarks in here. Ah, oh, that'd be cool to go down there. How does one get up? No. For a second I thought this was going to be like steaming hot or something. But I guess I am wearing my suit. There we go. That's better. There? Oh, maybe over here. Ugh, just launch myself into the side of the cliff. Oop. Ah, there. Floating jellies. That reminds me of something in Skyrim, I think. I can't remember the area. I guess down we go. Oh! Oh, what's this? Neon plants? Ooh. 
Do not stab yourself in those. I think. There's the way out. No crazy animals in there. Eh? Eh? What is that? What is that? Is that something dragging down a that look like a human corpse? Mmm, I don't know. I don't know. It would not surprise me. Nope. Okay. Hmm, maybe there aren't any creep. Ooh. Maybe there aren't any actual snacks, but this must be something new, like a, some weird alien jellyfish coming out of the ground. Ah, so that could be like a the water version of those things that hang off the ceiling and pick you up. Oh, I'm so tempted to just jump into it. It's got me! It's got me! Ah. Oh, all right, okay. How does one... Yeah, that was new. Very new. Very cool. I won't do that again. Watch out for those tentacles. Yep. 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 I know what I'm doing. Do I? Ah, okay. I thought there was some creature underwater making those splashes. Um, very hard to see in here. Way out is not obvious. Unless this is some form of dead end. Hmm. This was the only way, I thought, into this area. Ooh, no. Nothing, nothing. No holes. No tunnels. Hmm. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Can't do anything with those, I don't think. Hang on, let me just go back. Maybe it's a dead end. Maybe it's just a pretty dead end. Nah, that's not a dead end, is it? Not seeing something. Take that. <clears throat> Sorry, I did not mean to take out my frustrations on you, but you were there. I don't know. I do not know. I'm just gotta swim around until something becomes obvious. In there. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go back. Is there something really obvious that I'm missing? I don't think so. I don't think so. Ugh. 
Ew, there's a few of you. And I must have come through there, right? Sorry for the backtracking. Uh, <coughs> Two of them. Jay, did I swim in here before? Or oh, is this the way out? Oh, that was another way out. That's right. This is obviously the way out. Sorry. I did. I forgot. I forgot I saw that other opening. <laughs> this other opening here. Okay. Now yeah, I got some more snarkies. And not a lot of ammo. Great. Maybe if I could just take one of these two out, that might just make it a bit easier. Yeah. Just come a bit closer. Ah, oh, what a waste! Don't waste it! Do not waste your ammo. I think I'm wasting my ammo. Yep. That works, does it? It's like shooting fish in the barrel. <laughs> Yeti. Come closer. Radiation. Better than a fishing rod. Ooh. Okay, that thing is not coming over here. There's a lot of them. There's a lot. Yeet. Oh my gosh. Wow, that was unexpected. This is the next best way to fish. Though I don't have a barrel. I have a big pond. Oh, I can still hit him. Oh, come flying out when you're dead. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's right. I can't, I can't fire. Can't fire a gun underwater. Still alive? Yeah, you're dead. There you go. Come to the surface. Now, I bet you there's more. Oh, you made a decent distance. I commend you. Where to? This way. Oh. Nice snacks. What? 
Yo! Can't a man take a break around here? The answer to that is no. Definitely not. Not on New Zealand. Wow! Whoa, that's impressive. How glorious does that look? Wow. It does spoil my sightseeing. Though I think you're trying to help me. I'm gonna die if I fall down there. Yeah. Wait up. Now this is the place to stay. So that's the sound of another explorer's body. Oh no. It's just the sound of the beacon, isn't it? Wow. Wow. Now, I've this I definitely don't really recall from the original. In fact, is that is that what we've seen uh, when we first entered Zen? And he, uh, you get the title for Zen and you see that something like this in the distance. I think I was looking at it before, I believe. That was it. No, that was that had smoke count coming out of it. So this is something different. All right. How to get there? How to get the uh, this way? Yeah. Nothing worth blowing up. Tentacle water creatures. And I'll bet you complete with a set of snarks. Although they would catch the snarks, wouldn't they? So maybe that maybe there aren't. Yeah. Well, the physics are weird. I heard that. Oh, I heard that. Snark. Oh, I can't shoot underwater. Damn it. Oh. 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 I see. I gotta blow this all up. Don't mind if I do. It's on the other side. Yeah. What are they? Ah, oh, they're the uh, those tentacle creatures. <gasps> they're the freaking snark. <gasps> Hang on, I'm about to drown. I'm about to drown. There's a snark. 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 Aren't you a scary face? Hmm. Alright. Okay. If I just simply shoot them with the arrow, I think they're gonna blow up. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Take a beating. Okay. Okay. Um.
Yeah, actually that makes sense. I'll just do that. So simple. Yeah, I think got out. And that's That gave me a fright. Oh. Go away. Gonna have to hit my way through this. See, I'm protected. Leaving your bottoms unprotected. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh man. Yeah, those guys. Oh yeah, you can so you've got a few different ways you can kill them. I'll just shoot a path. Ah, yeah, really cool. I like how they uh, they design those. Did all right. The rocks and the health spa combo on Zen. Yeah, I could I could charge money for this. Why do we have to go to war? Just you let us it'd be like Bali, you know. Let us pay a couple hundred bucks for a trip. Let us line your pools and next to your armor rocks. Down. Okay. Okay. Pass the snarks. This has to take us somewhere. Well, maybe we're going to go back out to the uh, to space. That was something that was in the uh, in the in the old one. I'm trying to take a lid off that isn't there. There's a lot of uh, jumping across um, rotating platforms and, and things like that, so I wonder if there will be a segment where there's a lot of that happening. Oof. Oh yes, there's that thing. And this dude made it so close. What the fuck? Well done you. Well done you. Oh. You're a bit bloody. Yeah. Let me enjoy. Wow. It really is, it really is awesome. <laughs> Getting tongue tied. Getting tongue tied in the majesty of Zen. Music rises. Stay away! Very nice. I know that they're really for, you know, killing those dogs, but I seem to like using the bullets directly on the animals themselves. Yeah, I want to go up. Lovely music too, I have to say that.
in fact when when this was very very first released and I'm, I'm a little bit familiar with the tracks because I have listened to them um, I guess over the last few years on and off excuse me as I was saying the music is really really well done in this game I have to say expands the envir environments Whoa! You were going to be uh, that creature's meal, weren't you? It really is something to behold. I like a good backdrop. I like a good colour scheme. What am I walking on anyway? This is just a whole bunch of roots. <laughs> Do not push me off. Oh, oh not the fire ones. Not the fire ones. Yes, just blow up. Oh. Walk close to that one. Or that one. Yeah, I think I got away from them. I don't think that they can follow me up on this hill. Mmm, yeah, now you're back. Oh, Jay. They just, they're all hiding. I need something a bit quicker. Let's do try again. Okay. Professional fall. I am now on the floating island, which means I've come from the other place, which was also a floating island. Man. Epic. Just epic. Love it. Love it. Crawl. No doggies better catch me out here. Do not fall through the cracks either. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to reach the uh, that sackball creature. What is that creature called again? Meanwhile, while I was thinking about the name of that creature, I fell off the edge. Idiot. Yeah. Stay on the path this time, hey? Alright, um Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And then some crazy jump. Cross the Third time lucky. Okay. 
save. <gasps> yes. Yes. I mean, you know. Are there any shops on Zen? Is this just simply the common route? Thank you. Well, it seems that we're moving, we're definitely moving up. I think we're aiming to get on top of this. There. Yo. Yo. Coral. Growing at the, uh, the edges. Ah. I mean, quite a lot of you guys made it. Pretty far. I'm impressed. Look up, just look up. Not too, not too far. That you fall off the edge again. There we go. Rock and pool is nice and cool. Hmm. What is that? Some doorway? Battery powered doorway? Whoops, wrong back. They blew up, didn't they? Eight shells. Um, okay. I suppose I must have to go through here. This can't be human tech. That has to be combine. Alright. Um, I get up here. I assume... Here. And then up there. Clever. Cool. Very good. I like that. Definitely not human tech. Man, what is this? This is cool. This is definitely not in, in the uh, old version. I don't even remember any sort of... Uh, Approximus, approximization of this sort of look. Don't remember any alien tech. Hey! It's bulletproof! Oh, there are buttons. They are. What have I done? Did I just open up another portal? What have I done? Huh. 
Huh. Gordon, he's always doing. Always touching something he shouldn't be. Looking for another. Batra Aziz. Buggy. Yar. No, can't plug it into there. Not sure if this is a good idea. Should you be unplugging doors? Uh, this is definitely a point of no return. Firing lasers? That's kind of very similar to what was happening in the uh, Lambda Labs. That's a very orange looking space. I'm assuming I shouldn't fall. I think I have to go there. Yes, definitely have to go there. Okay, I might have survived that. What? What? Alien lift. Oh. You know what? You're much better than our human counterparts. It's another area. So what am I doing? I'm just essentially turning on the place. Very different. Very different. And... There you go, that's cool. Nope. I guess you go there. Okay, that's supposed to be like that. Alright, so that's turned on something. This is very Lambda Labs like. Ah, yep, that's open. Hey, I need you. Oh, that was a button. Well then. I mean, what does that remind you of? I mean, that's straight out of, um... Oh, is it Half-Life 2? Or was it Episode 1? Episode 1, I think, when you have to go back into the Citadel... Citadel and... You gotta turn these these laser beams on to sort of stop the um, the core reactor from ex exploding or at least giving it some time. In all right, so we found. I think I need to find another crystal, power crystal. Okay, it's been there. Um. Maybe another one in there, or is that just the other side? Yeah, of this. Just the other side. Um, no other space to go. Oh. I guess I just jump. Before. Cue more glorious music. No. 
How can a leaf survive in the vast expanses of space? This whole thing must have atmosphere. As you know, because I'm wearing my suit, as I keep forgetting. Oh. Oof. Oh. Yes. Satisfying. The mass murder of the indigenous wildlife. Um, where do I go? Back there. And now maybe this way? Yes. Oh, that was close! How the heck did I make that? <laughs> oh, what is going on there? More alien tech? Jutting out of a random floating rock in space? No! Oh. oh, please tell me I saved it. to simply jump straight through there, can we? Got some like tentacles just dangling right across that. Uh, yeah, dead tongues. Okay. How does one get past there? Just jump. Well, that didn't work. That definitely didn't work. Ew. Ugh. Oh, I'll tell you what. I'll stop it here. I'll find out how. I'm assuming I have to turn that shield off, obviously, get through it. And once I sh turn that off, I'll have to kill the tentacle creatures and then I'll get over on the other side. Sounds simple enough. But I will do that in the next one. So um, thanks for watching. Um, if you're enjoying this as much as I am, please give me a like. Uh, tell me how well or how terribly I'm doing. I don't mind that. And uh, even subscribe so you'll, uh, you'll know when I put the next one up, which I guess is going to be the next part of Zen. Um, I was thinking maybe I might come across what's going on with your tongue. I thought I was going to see the, I'll uh, come across that, um, is it, is it, what do you call it? Is it Garganass? I don't know what you call it. Hmm, the ball sack creature. So maybe in the next one. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>